It's Mario Sports Mix on the Nintendo Wii, a collection of four sports games featuring Nintendo's characters. At first, I was like, oh no, another collection of lousy minigames on the Wii, but wait, there's more, more quality in one game in this collection than most other collections of minigames combined. In fact, don't think of this as a collection of minigames. It's not. It's just four good sports games included in Mario Sports Mix. But some are better than others, and I think volleyball is one of the best. A game that usually does not make for a good video game, in my opinion. But this one succeeds because it has terrific controls, it plays well, it has classic Nintendo charm, and it's fun. The setup is actually very similar to Nintendo's own Mario Kart. I'm going to start off by competing in the Mushroom Cup, which is painfully easy after you've figured out the controls, but it'll do to show you how the game is played. Incidentally, the other games in this collection are dodgeball, basketball, and hockey. I'll be looking at each individually. I am disappointed that rollerball was not included. The sport of the future. You can play with up to four players, four human players, two or three person teams. This is a single player game where the other two players on my team are computer controlled, which are smarter than average. The AI in this game is pretty good. You'll figure out a lot just by watching, but in short, what you're going to do is jump in the air and spike the ball. You control your aim using the thumbstick on the nunchuck and fling the Wii controller to actually hit the ball. It goes far beyond mere controller waggling and is very fun, and gets a lot more challenging as you reach the harder difficulty levels and your opponents actually learn some defense. Obviously, playing against humans is the most fun, and this game does have Nintendo online support, so you can do just that even if you're not in the same room together. I have my special powers saved up, and like to see the enemy driven before me and hear the lamentations of the other Nintendo characters as they lose. During gameplay, you collect coins and power-ups. You can use some of the items to perform a more powerful item spike, or just launch shells and bombs at your opponents to disorient them. And I think that the three-person teams actually get a bit crowded. Two-person teams make for a more challenging game. This is the last round in the Mushroom Cup, with a clever Nintendo-style net. There's unlockable characters, and you can play as your me. Here's the setup screen. All very intuitive and easy to use. It's like Wii Sports Resort mixed with Mario Kart. Moogle! You know what this game could use? Some Kenny Loggins. Good times, you really can't go wrong with this one, and volleyball is just one quarter of the whole. There's four games in Mario Sports Mix after all, but don't let its possible association with minigames scare you off. This really works much better than most of the third-party minigame compilations. <laughs> By a mile. Mario Sports Mix. I'll see you back here for the next part of the review where I'm playing hockey. Five for fighting, give me a game misconduct, it's getting real. <laughs>